Hello everybody. I am trying to get this little update on a couple of situations. First thing, I got the ASIC. Okay. Now I think after six days I can make an honest um, sort of evaluation on what has happened thus far. Uh, when I first got it, okay. First off, the first thing that happened was when I called them, they, uh, I was filling the application out online. Okay, I wanted to get the, uh, the trial offer. I know how this works. They're going to start sending you refills right away, and you're going to have to pay for them, and you haven't even had the opportunity to try this shit out, right? So I call them. All right, I mean, I get online, I start to fill the thing out, and then when you get to the very end, it says you will be billed 120 some odd dollars every month for the refills. Okay? I'm like, no way. I stop filling it out. The next day, I get uh, on my cell phone, uh, I keep getting a local phone number that I don't recognize. Local meaning in Albuquerque because it was a different uh, prefix, so I knew it was in state, but not right here. And um, it's a man named Jeffrey, and he tells me, um, you know, the thing is, is when you first get the kit, if you don't, if you're not going to be a, a full heavy, you know, full-time smoker, you're not going to need that many refills, you, you know, how much do you smoke? I told him, you know, like half a pack, sometimes less a day, because I make a pack of cigarettes last me about three days if I had to. And um, he says, oh, well, you only need about... Uh, a dozen of these little deals right here. The little car. I'm not gonna show you everything yet. This little cartridge part right here, and this is supposed to get you something like 500 puffs. Okay. I'm like, okay, so I only need like a dozen or less. And he's like, yeah, that's all you're gonna need. I'm like, okay. And so how much is that gonna be? It's like 20 some odd bucks a month. I'm like, okay, that I can swing. All right. He says, but uh, <clears throat> and also to you know sweeten the deal. I'm going to send you um, a free car charger and uh, some extra little deals and expedite the shipping for five bucks more. I'm like, okay, great, do that because I wanted it before I left to go take my mom for her surgery. Okay, the day before that, it still hasn't showed up. I call them. I'm like, where's my box? I was supposed to get expedited shipping. It should have already been here. Now, I'm not dealing with Jeffrey anymore. I'm dealing with someone in Indonesia. Okay? I swear. Could barely understand what she's saying. She can barely understand what I'm saying. She's like, I'm so sorry, ma'am, but I will call you, uh, I will going to give you credit for this, going to give you credit for that, going to send you this, going to send you, uh, okay, just send me the package, and do not charge me for expedited shipping. Well, ma'am, that's already been charged to your account, but that $5 was for the car charge. I'm like, no. That was offered to me for free, and the $5 was for expedited shipping. Well, I'm sorry, ma'am, that didn't happen, so it's on its way. I'm like, okay, great. Okay. Go take my mom to her surgery. I get home. Um, it's still not here. Okay. It comes the next day. All right. So I go, and I wish that I could find the little box, but I've been cleaning my room, and I stuck it somewhere. But I had been online and I had been looking at what everybody else got for the 99 bucks, and they got a really nice package in a box about this big with two of this white part. This white part is the battery. The, and the atomizer is right here on this end part, okay? And then these things, no, 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 I'm sorry, the atomizer is in here. The atomizer is in here, okay? And these little dealies, is what is holding the um, nicotine in there, okay? So you're just getting straight atomized nicotine. You're not getting all that 
chemicals and all that other stuff, you're just getting the nicotine, okay? Which will make it either easier for you to quit or, you know, in the very least, it's not as dangerous as all the chemicals, the other crap that you're, you know, getting out of the cigarette, okay? So, okay, great. So, it arrives, it is in a little teeny box, and it has, this is the size of the box it was in, because this is what came out of it. It's got a USB charger, not a wall charger, which is what was supposed to come with the kit. It's got one, two, three, four. This was the dummy one that was on the sig. Five regular tobacco, clearly marked on the outside box, regular tobacco after I stressed, I don't know how many times. Do not send me regular. Send me menthol. I will be so pissed off. <laughs> okay. You send me regular. I hate it. Okay. That and then this little gel is right in here. Okay. And that's what they tried to get me. Oh, and then what it came with was another little box of the menthol refills. Yes. Uh, it says 24 men, which is the uh, degree of menthol, not, it's only six, it's five plus one refills in there. See that? Okay. That came with it. And another little box is the Charger Plus car adapter for USB charger. Okay. So that means that you still, I'm trying to make sense of it as I look at it tells you how to use it on the box. This goes in your car. You stick this USB charger in there. And then you can charge that in the car. Okay, and it has to charge two and a half hours. Okay, but what everyone else got for the same amount as they were trying to charge me, like I said, was a very nice big box, real party. I looked them up on YouTube. I did a little research. You know, uh, six of these little refills, two of these so that while you have one charging, you have the other one at your disposal, <clears throat> and this and the USB charger plus the wall charger, okay, all in this nice big display box, right, nice box. Mine came in a crappy manila folder just thrown together uh, and uh, obviously wasn't even the right order. I didn't get my wall charger. I did get the USB charger, but I wasn't even quite sure that this was working, and I'm going to tell you, it, well, it wasn't working. It, it wasn't working properly. Um, so I call back, and I say, look, you didn't send me what I ordered. You, you know, you made me take this stuff. Uh, now I realize that what you're charging me for is nowhere near what everybody else was getting for 99 bucks. Don't even think you're going to get 99 bucks out of me for that. Oh ma'am, well we're giving a we're giving a um, promotional right now, and it's thirty three dollars. I said, okay, I can live with that, you know, because it's the charger, and I want my wall charger. Yes, ma'am, I'm gonna send it right out, and I want a refund on these five regular for the menthol. Yes, ma'am, and she says, and I'm also gonna extend your. Um, your trial for uh, two more weeks. I said, okay. So, the wall charger still has not arrived. I called yesterday and talked to another man in Hong Kong. <laughs> and he tells me that um, he's very sorry. And let me tell you that their customer service is so apologetic and so sweet. And they really are trying. I'm going to give him a pat on the back. Because when you're dealing with people... <laughs> that are smoking and you're messing with their nicotine and you're messing, you know, and they're trying to quit and they're trying not to go buy cigarettes and they're trying, you know, most people that are doing this, I would assume, are on the, either on the road to quitting smoking or whatever. But anyway, you don't mess with that. You get them on the phone. You can't understand them. It's frustrating as I'll get out. And, you know, let me tell you, and like, they stick to that little script like, glue and it's a good thing because um you know if they were to vary off it would get ugly okay um you know so i am going to give them that 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 the customer service um tries to be helpful however they don't know anything about the actual product all they can do is adjust the order and 
and help you, um, you know, if your order is messed up, reorder something or this or that or the other. But as far as knowing, okay, they don't know why the thing's not working properly, right? Okay, so I have this other package of these. These are supposed to last you 500 drags, uh, little filter, I swear. Uh, they, the first one lasted me like a day, 24 hours. The second one, the third one, the fourth one, and the fifth one, I have been sucking till my cheeks collapsed when it should be like this. Watch. A little vaporizer in there is vaporizing the oil that's inside of here, the nicotine oil. Well, it wouldn't vaporize, which meant I wasn't getting any nicotine which led me to believe that the atomizer thing was broken inside and it's not working. So when I called him yesterday, I was screaming and yelling, that thing is not working. Uh, what the hell is the problem? You know, uh, I'm being for, you know, I'm like, I'm not getting any nicotine and I'm getting madder and madder and madder, of course, because I'm now really at like day three in the midst of quitting, you know, without it because it's not been working properly. And I've tried like every one of those. I saved those little menthol ones. I wish I could reach it. Let me see. I saved the little menthol ones. And I was trying to even like, and put, setting them upright in this little cap, trying to see, you know, because it said, it, you know, if the oil gets, you know, misplaced, it won't function properly, and all this kind of stuff. Okay. So that's what they look like. So I'm saving those, and I'll tell you why I'm going to save them. Because you can buy a little vial of drops, which I found out about this big, for 12 bucks, refill those, and not buy any more of these little inserts until you just need fresh ones or whatever. Okay? Okay, so number one, that's what I'm going to be doing. And number two, I'm so upset about them screwing me over on the little um, box and the extra battery and the, and the wall charger and all that that I, it caused me to do more and more research. So when I'm itching like crazy because I used some laundry soap that my husband, <laughs> that's what it is, the laundry soap that my husband got and, um, and I think I'm allergic to it because I can't, I can only use certain kinds of laundry soap. And now Anna, uh, I had gone to my trailer and got boxes and boxes of clothes. My, my son actually went for me and brought me a bunch of my clothes from up there and, um, and uh, I had to wash them all, and now I'm it. So anyway, I'm so I was so upset about that that um, caused me to do more research, which caused me to find the drops. You know, so obviously I'm no dummy. I'm going to figure out a way, you know, to um, get the drops. And if I can find this little doohickey somewhere, which I'm sure I can, for a whole lot less than even thirty three dollars but I have I have a good feeling that when I get the bill it's gonna be for ninety nine bucks still um and I'm not there's no way I'm paying ninety nine dollars for something that you know this is what I got and this everybody else got a cute little display box and I get all of this crap thrown in a bag you know no so anyway I'm gonna give it uh so anyway I tried I'm waiting on the refill, so I run to the post office this morning. They're still not there. I'm like, what the hell? Now it's uh, five days or four days since they've been mailed out. Um, so I had to come home and try this this regular one. I didn't have a choice. It's either that or go buy a pack of cigarettes. I do not want to do that. You know, I'm trying to stick to the program. And um, so it worked just fine. So what I figured out was... It wasn't the atomizer, it's the stupid, um, these little things must have been dry as bone. Um, you know, the little refills, this one that I've been saving. So, I've got five of these to last me from today. Let's see, one, two, three, four, yeah, five. Started this one this morning. Today is December, what? Uh, it's Saturday. So I'm going to really keep track of how long um, these last me and see 
if they're anywhere near, I mean, 500 um, drags is like 50 cigarettes. If you get like even 10 drags off a cigarette, which I don't, I usually do like three or four. So that one should last me like weeks. It's not going to, obviously, you know. But I am going to keep track of it today, and when this one starts running dry, I will keep track of it and figure it out, but it's nowhere near that. I can tell you that already. So, for the overall product, I like the way it looks. I like the way it feels. I like the way when the vapor is working. See, it's almost out already. This is almost out already, and I just used it since right before I made this video. Let's try it again. Okay, see how it's doing that now? Now it needs charged again. Uh, it, it needs charged again. So, anyway, what I did like about it, which I'm trying to explain to you. Where did the little thing go? <laughs> oh, there it is. Uh, is that um, I like the amount of vapor. I like the way it feels in your mouth. I like the flavor of it, even on these regular ones, is not, is not that bad. Um, now this is a bummer because this has to sit for two and a half hours, okay? So you take, now on this, no, you don't pull that off. This just screws right into this little round hole in the, um, charger. Anyway, uh, you know, part of it, yes, is because I really am being forced <laughs> to quit when I'm not, you know, that wasn't where I was at, and, uh, but it's okay, you know, I can deal with it, I'm not a, uh, you know, I'll be alright, <laughs> I will get through it, and I do want to quit anyway, but I wanted to do it on my own terms and in my own way, and this is not working for me right now, uh, so I'm like going to give it a 5 out of 10, like I said, I like the product itself when it is working properly, I like the way the cigarette looks and feels, they have these in colors, Oh, that's another thing. When I had the girl on the uh, phone about the customer service, I asked her, is there anywhere that I can uh, um, buy accessories or other, you know, types of cigarettes? Oh, no, ma'am, there's nothing like that. Okay, well, then I get online for the, uh, the exact name of their product, which is, um, what is it called? I'm looking at my history where I just... Let me see. It's 51 is the type. Okay. 51 is the type. Oh, gosh. Did I just now mess up my movie, too? Oh. <laughs> no. There it is. Okay. <laughs> oh, no! Anyway, um, I'm going to give it a 5. So far, so good. A 5 out of 10. And they're probably lucky they're getting that. And if I don't, if that wall charger doesn't show up by Monday with my menthol refills, I just will be actually calling and canceling the order um, and finding something on eBay that is refillable that I can just um, do myself. And, of course, I'll keep all these copy load cartridges. And I'll, um, I'll have that figured out. So, anyway. Did it take me 20 minutes to talk about that? Okay, well, 18 minutes about the e -cig. 